I'm a pretty good cook too, you know. Probably. Damn, she not sure. If you'd asked, I would have whipped up some box lunches. Easy as pie. Yeah. Uh, let me think about. No. Get him. Oh, damn, Yosuke. An Inaba Credit Union ATM to the north of town was destroyed today by an earth mover. And all cash inside was stolen. The hell is an earth mover? They got things that can move the earth? The vehicle, which was abandoned at the scene, had been reported stolen by a local contractor. Oh, that's what they mean. Since the culprit was able to act quickly before the security guards arrived on the scene, the police have... <sighs> No, Nanako, it's going to be all right. That's late. Yo, that dude really took like a construction truck and like and stole the whole ATM machine, bro. He said to give you the phone. Yes. Yo, Dojima. I can't take those days off. Hey, yo, Dojima, let me holler at you. Hold on. Nah, she can't go to Junet. Hey, yo, Dojima. Lock up. Boy, I'm about to square up. What you mean you can't take those days off? She really wanted to go to Juness. For some reason, you dreamed that Marie was chasing you. Oh, I'm even dreaming about her. It was heart pounding, but your relationship with Marie has intensified. Victory. Nanako, you good? Oh, morning. Good morning. Watching TV. You want to go? I'll take it to Junette. Wait a minute. Who, who, who rang the doorbell? Dojima got a key. And I got this golf club. Hey, yo, who, who really risking it right now? Oh, Chie, baby, you can't be doing that. You almost almost had to hit you on your knees. Oh, cool. You're home. Hey, if you're free today, want to go somewhere? Yukiko's coming, too. I got Nanako. I can't. How about you, Nanako-chan? Wanna come? Oh, okay. I might have to really hurt somebody, though. Um, come with... I don't want to bring her out there. I don't, There's people out there. Would you rather watch the... I want her to be comfortable. Huh? I... I can come? Yes! Of course you can! You decided to take... Yeah, we can bring Nanako, bro! Let's get it. Ooh, if anybody try anything. Ooh, if anybody try anything. Yosuke put the clean. Bring poor Nanako chan to a place like this on Golden Week. He put the clean coat back on. I see you, Yosuke. Where else is there to go? I love Juness. See, she wanted to come to Juness anyway. Nanako chan. But we're supposed to go on a real trip somewhere. We were going to make box lunches. We can still put them in the box. If anybody try to mess with you, I'm going to put them in the box too. Wow, you can make boxed lunches, Nanako-chan? Oh, so you're the family cook? Pretty impressive, big bro. Hey, Chie, I kind of like it. Big bro. <laughs> She said the Whoa, thing. You can cook? Well, you do seem to be great with your hands. Uh, uh never mind. Come on, Yosuke. Don't make it awkward. What, what did... Come on, now. I'm a pretty good cook, too, you know. Probably. Damn, she not sure. If you'd asked, I would have whipped up some box lunches. Easy as pie. Yeah. Uh, let me think about... No. Get him. Oh, damn, Yosuke. What makes you think I can't cook? Let's have a cook-off and see for ourselves. I don't know. He got that Juness training. My, my. Doth the lady protest too much? And hey, I never said I cooked. But I have this weird feeling like I'd win anyway. Oh. <laughs> I can understand that. Yeah, Yukiko looking as good as Yukiko looks. What the? Yukiko! Here, Nanako-chan can be our judge. I bet we'll make something that ranks up there with your mom's cooking, Nanako-chan. I don't have a mom. She died in an accident. Damn, Yosuke, I got slappy real quick for that comment. Sorry, I didn't know. 
It's okay. Even if I don't have a mom, I have dad with me. And now I have a brother, too. <laughs> Come on, Nanako-chan. Let's go get a soda. Okay. All right, well, make sure it ain't none of that, like, heavy sugar-filled stuff. I'm trying to take care of her early. You feel me, Yosuke? She's a strong girl. Yeah, she makes me feel like I'm the little kid here. Notice how how I, I never took my eyes off of where she went, right? Never, I'm not taking my eyes off her. Man, everybody just left me at the table. Do you want something too? Yeah, um, whatever you bring me. Yes! Yeah, like I don't Maria and I call good like those are the top two confidants for me right now, bro. Can we spend time with already? <laughs> Tanaka's wonderful commodities. Hey, they brought the wonderful commodities. Oh, why they gotta put them next to each other like this? Why I gotta do me like this, game? Come on, son. That's not fair, bro. Ah, 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 what's a man to do? Okay, okay, we'll go with Chie because we haven't hung out with Chie yet. Chie, let's get it. Need to tone. Oops. I need to hone my kicking skills or I won't be able to use them in battle. <laughs> I tried practicing at home, but my mom and dad yelled at me for putting a hole in the shoujo. Damn, what you kicking holes in the wall for, baby? Still, now's the time to train, right? You goddamn right it is. She got that, like, Rock Lee guy sensei type vibe about her. Right. Let's train, Chi. Hey, let's train. Yeah, she's more physical, so we can get rid of the ice. Because I got Jack Frost. I'll handle the ice. At people is going to get us. She's going to be like a very crit-heavy physical damage type persona. Can I can I chill with Nanako? You sent someone watching. Yo, somebody watching me from at the shrine, bro? This dusty old place. Come at me. Come out here. You feeling froggy. Then tadpole leap on out here, boy. I make frog legs out your stomach. What? Whoa. What's up with the fox, bro? That baby has on does not match like this intense look he's giving off. Whoa. I'll fight a fox. The fox is staring at you. Hey. You notice an Emma plaque in its mouth. Is he here to okay you're here to help? Okay, we can be friends too. It reads, please help grandma's it's legs. Stupid. Someone has a wish written on. Okay, we have to help somebody's grandmother. Okay. If my legs don't heal, I can't maintain the shrine. That and won't be able to visit Kaida anymore. He's my grandson. Okay, so it's his grandson wants us to help him fix his his grandparents' legs. Okay. The old man stuck the leaf onto his leg. It's working. What kind of leaf was that? Medicinal weed? Whoa. What was that? This dude just did like the Mario jump. What kind of leaf did you get? Yo, what was on that leaf, bro? It might have been drugs. See how fast he was? He about to go rob somebody moving that fast, bro. Hey, Fox, let me borrow one of those leaves, bro. It seems that it's taking a liking to you. Oh, what's, what's up, Fox? Are you going to become my companion? The prime suspect in yesterday's ATM robbery in northern Inaba was arrested earlier today. Like, who steals an entire ATM, bro? You still got to, like, find a way to get into it. You steal that whole machine, but still can't get the money out of it. The alleged thief is Pomena Sushin. A 26-year-old former employee of the company which reported the stolen vehicle. I mean, with a name like Pumina, I understand. Welcome back! Nanako. I'm sorry I broke my promise again. Now you gonna come in with the big old Juness bag to try to, you know, put Band-Aid on the wound. Oh, um, my big bro and his friends played with me instead. That's right. I see. Thanks. Oh, that's a Juness bag. <laughs> What's in it? 
I hope something good. <laughs> good eye. Well, today is Children's Day. So I brought you a present. Oh, snap. Bam! Look, that's the limited... That's the limited edition. What is that? Limited edition t-shirt, baby. What is that? What the fuck is that on the front of it? Why is that a duck? Oh, it was a platypus. Okay. Oh, why do the holidays have to end so fast? At least they were peaceful. I listened in on the housewives gossiping at Juness, but it doesn't seem like anything happened. And I haven't heard anything about someone disappearing suddenly either. You think Yukiko could have been the last of the victims? No, it's not over. Not over at all. Hmm. Got people stealing ATM machines out there. You know, midterms. Oh, midterms. Uh, you had to go and bring that up. I don't want to think about it. I'm an ace it. I don't know about you though, Yosuke. Hey, Yosuke. Why don't you have Yukiko go over some of the material with you? Hmm? Oh, that's right. Yukiko's ranked at the top on every exam. Not this one. Get him! Maybe I should ask her for some private lessons. What did you say? Wait a minute now. Hold on. Let yo calm down, Yosuke. P private lessons? Chill. Huh? What's wrong? She giving me private lessons, buddy. There you go. Ow! What was that for? I'm just asking you to help me study. It was a little uh, excessive, Yukiko. You were talking about studying. What in the hell did you think we were talking about, Yukiko? <laughs> I thought it might have been an off-color joke. Arian has had some strange visitors lately. What kind of people have been coming up and you, you need me in there with this golf club? Yeah. Look at his head shaking. Yo, you, <laughs> Yosuke shaking that head hard, ain't he, boy? Junette, okay, my boy on the clock. He ain't had to change those boots. Are those the girls that? Oh no! Oh, Hanamura, yo, Yosuke, ignore, ignore. Her. I'm about to. Oh, if she walk over here, I'm had to fry her up like butter in the pan. Don't walk over here, girl. You in the danger zone? What's with the crowd today? It's way busy. If I had known, I would have skipped out. Girl, I'm about to have to get on you with that little mini cinnamon bun roll you got on the top of your head, girl. Get that on. head look like your head about to bust open. Get on. And bright yellow. Ew, is that a dress or is that a shirt with the jean shorts underneath of it? Get on! Girl, you dressed like you didn't know what the weather was going to be today. Your long sleeve dress, but you got the short, got the short shorts on with the cowboy boots. Get on! That's the same outfit you was wearing last week. You ain't got no more clothes. Get on! Isn't she dressed like the girl on the front of the salt box? Get on! Please don't. You got a bonus for today, right? What you mean she got a bonus for today? Yeah, a whole 500 yen. Hey, you talking shit too, girl? I get up. Well, wait a minute. You look kind of good. You looking a lot better than you know your right banana lady over here. Get on. What's the point then? What's the point? I'm about to put the point of this golf club in between your eyes. At this rate, my graduation trip will be somewhere in Japan. Maybe I should ask my parents to pay for it. Why don't you find a guy to pay? You should ask your parents to pay for a new outfit. Get on. <laughs> like Saki did. Oh, no. Oh no, we gotta fight them, Yosuke. Bro, I know they. F Yo, let me throw this table at them. All of them. Yosuke is about to hands lip. Bro, let me bite them. Was it during our second year when Saki eloped? I mean, oh my gosh. Yep, apparently she got with the college guy who came home and went off with him. But she came right back saying she'd save money and leave on her own. You mean she was dumped? Who knows? She started working here to save money, didn't she? You know, us high school girls can make easy money if we really wanted to. The pair's gossiping continues. Ooh. <sighs> it doesn't matter. It's just hot air. I'm not letting it get to me. All right, well, let me get to them. Let me bring this chair, this table over. We're the only ones who can avenge Saki Senpai. So there's no need to bother with outsiders. Outsiders, I'm about to throw them outside. Huh? You know what? You're right. <laughs> You're right. Ooh, I'm gonna wait till Yosuke turn around. I'm, 
hit one of them in the back of the head with this folded chair. You feel your relationship with Yosuke has grown deep. All right, but I ain't gonna let her get away with what she's saying back there. She back there dressed like a rejected Disney Channel show. Get him! Oh. She back there dressed like she cooks unseasoned food. Get him! Oh. A dried up pickle in a plastic bag. Dojima, what the hell is this? Hey, get that courage. Uh-oh. Dang it. That pickle put me down, bro. That pickle put <laughs> I lost to the pickle. Hey, Chie. I bought you a new copy of that Trial of the Dragon flick. You a good guy, Yosuke. You a good guy. This is clearly getting closer. Huh? What are you, scared of a little lightning? Quiet, you! I'd be a goner if even one of those things hit me. Oh. Ah! Oh, I grad TA. I got your back. <laughs> You're freaking out way too much. Come on, shouldn't weather like this help with your kung fu training? A bolt of lightning would hit, and it'd give you the inspiration for a new move. There was a scene like that in your DVD, wasn't there? You jerk! You don't even care how I feel. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, power's out. Huh? School's over. Class out. Class out. Class out. We gotta go. School's over. School's done. What are you looking at me for? Uh, why did this have to happen? Hey, Yukiko, can we just go home? Chie, do you know this story? Hmm. A girl forgot her homework, so she snuck into school in the middle of the night, but she suddenly needed to use the bathroom. Go on. She ventured into the girl's room where all the lights were off. No one should have been there, but in the mirror. In the mirror. Hold it right there. What are you talking about? Let her finish, G.A. Huh? It's a ghost story. I thought you liked them. Yeah, but why tell it now? It's the best ambiance. It's ambiance. She's on the verge of tears. What should I do? Hug her. Oh, I kind of wanted to scare it. No, we can't do that. We can't. Can we do this? Thanks. I'm glad you're here. I got your back, baby. Where's Welcome Marie? Room. Where's Marie? Pretending to those of us who reside within the velvet room. piece of paper on the floor oh. Huh. oh Marie you're back I didn't do it it wasn't me it was Margaret what is this what are you doing I mean what are you doing I not doing anything did you look no are you always lying <laughs> Marie looks very relieved. Just forget this happened. All of it. Affirmative. I'm hypnotizing you now. Sleep. Sleep. You didn't see anything. Now wake up. <laughs> that is quite an interesting reaction. Is what is on the paper really that embarrassing? Let's go. You wanna go see school? Oh, we're taking Marie to school, bro. <laughs> no! God! What's up? Yosuke, again? Really? Nanako! What's up? Seems to be lost in thought. Um, well... I made flowers at school yesterday. Oh, okay. They said today is Mother's Day. Oh, no. My teacher told us that's a day when you give your mom flowers. Oh, shoot. I don't have a mom, so I don't know what to do with these flowers. <coughs> give them the Tadojima. Huh? But it's Mother's Day. Is it okay to give them to Dad? Yep. Okay, then I'll give them to him. Um, I did a really good job. Yes. My teacher said they were pretty. Your teacher was correct. <laughs> I wonder if Dad will be happy to get them. He better be. You should make a flower 
her too, big bro. Should I though? Then we can celebrate Mother's Day together. All right, not a cozy. We will do one. We'll do one. We did it. I'm the origami. I'm the most origamiest origamiest. What? Yeah, you could go. I'm gonna have the top score on this exam, baby. Hey, quiet down. So, what did you write for number seven? The one about what that referred to in the sentence? Huh. Um, I put her sorrowful expression. As incorrect. That wasn't the right answer. That wasn't the right answer at all. Hey, did you hear? A TV station's filming here in town. Uh oh. They're probably just doing more stuff about that hanging corpse case. Uh oh. No, it's not that. You know the highway nearby? They're gonna cover those biker gangs that hang around there. Uh-oh. A friend of mine goes to the biker meeting sometimes? I heard it from him. Dude, what are you doing hanging out with a guy in a biker gang? Hey, that's a good question. Well, anyways, what do you think about tomorrow's group blind date? We were gonna meet outside, but... A group blind date? Y'all some, some bold ones. Biker gang? Oh, yeah. They raise a ruckus from time to time. I guess your place is too far away to hear them. We live right by the road. The noise can drive you insane. I hear some guys at this school are part of it, too. Oh, what? Yeah, I know there are some rumors about a first-year student here who's a total hellraiser. One of the guys working at Jeunesse said the dude's been a legend ever since middle school. He ain't no legend. I'm the legend. Although, was he in a biker gang? Did you say he was a legend? Hold on, Yukiko. What? No, I I'm the legend. We training. Nanako, what's up? What you doing out here? Yo! What are you doing? You're training, of course. Hmm. Training? Who are you fighting with? I am her training partner. Ooh, that's a big... How big that grasshopper is, bro? Ah! That's a big-ass grasshopper. No, nah, she don't like grasshoppers. That ass Adachi keeps vanishing every now and again. I figure he's probably slacking off around Juness whenever he does. We did see him around there, but I can't tell you that. If you see him hanging around when you're at Juness, he's probably goofing around. So if you see a dachi at your nest, tell them all for me, okay? Alright. I don't know. It's something about a dachi, bro. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Young men recklessly riding their motorcycles, disturbing the peace of a quiet rural town. It's them bikers. Our special report took a turn for the violent when one of the apparent leaders attacked the camera crew. I mean, what y'all following them around with cameras for? What did y'all think was going to happen? doing here that voice this ain't a show get bent damn you told y'all to get bent still up to the same old tricks do you know him dad uh, well i know him through work mm-hmm speak on it his name's kanji tatsumi he's quite a handful he's been crushing biker gangs in the area since middle school but I thought he'd got into a high school and started attending class. Huh. Man, that blur sure is pointless. It's completely obvious who it is. It's not even blurred anymore. The guy's family runs a historic textile shop. I think what happened was he crushed the local bikers all by himself because the noise kept his mother up at night. It's a nice gesture, but he's way too violent. At this rate, his mother will have to apologize again. We gotta check out the Midnight Channel. Whoa, it started raining. I guess the weather report was right. That means the show's probably gonna be on tonight. I hope we don't see anyone. Yeah, that'd be best. But if we do, maybe we'll see some kind of clue that can point us toward the killer. Well, everyone, don't forget to check your TV tonight. Got it? Oh, uh, what are we about to see? Who's next? Who's next?
a figure appeared. That's the biker dude. Look at the head. 